What is going on guys? We are back with another video in our 49ers franchise. It is week 14 and we are going against the Texans who are a 3 and 9 team. However, you got Deshaun Watson, you got Hopkins, probably. I mean, who knows honestly. We just faced off against the Rams and it was easily the craziest game I've ever uploaded to the channel to be honest. And if you guys like uploading to the channel, like and subscribe. <laughs> Honestly, at this point, I'm just going to say whatever and, uh, you know, we're just going to go with it. But yeah, last game, the Rams, they destroyed us. We were humiliated, we were beaten, disgusted, and a little turned on. Honestly, just a little turned on. Maybe that's just me, but I'm just I'm just saying. Now, Petrowski, the, the future of this team. We will find out soon. Really? Oh, that's all the snaps? Maybe maybe we won't find out soon. Maybe we won't find out to the playoffs what his development is. But, yeah, uh, it, this is the offense. We did add Kittle to the list and took off Jimmy Garoppolo, which I believe, ironically, was, like, literally that game that we got destroyed, the biggest game that we got beat on all – well, the only game we got beat on all year – and there's the defense. Uh, some people are saying we should maybe change Bose's ability because he has unstoppable force for the actual rosters, but people seem like they didn't want those abilities to be reset at all. And it is whatever you guys want, honestly. You know, it is, I like playing the series no matter what, so it's really all about what you guys want to see. Uh, we're not going to worry about J.J. Watt because simply there's just nothing you can do about it. If he does well, he does well. If he doesn't, he doesn't. You know, we're going to try to double team him anytime we can. But there's no guarantees. There's, there just isn't with him. Here we are in another sunny situation. Texans, obviously not a great record, so it's not going to draw at that many eyes. Although it's a team that could easily sneak up on you on a, a schedule and, and take a win from you. I mean, I don't know why they would want to, but they're a good team that maybe was riddled by injury. Maybe that's why we're seeing a lower overall. You know, you see Watson, you see, you see Watt, you see Hopkins. It's kind of confusing to me that you see those names, so... I don't know. I'm not, I'm not sure exactly what happened. Maybe there were some injuries. They just came back. I have no clue. But yeah, they're a team that should not be as bad as they are. So we're going to be cautious. Definitely uh, tread lightly. But yeah, I I think this is good. This is a good back, bounce back game. I think we can easily stop their offense just for the fact that I don't really see them having much of a rushing threat. And, of course, our offense usually is pretty good. And we're playing against some really bad, uh, you know, cornerbacks. So they shouldn't be able to do the things that the Rams did. I know the Rams don't have great cornerbacks necessarily either, but this team is even worse. So we should be able to take care of their their defense pretty well. So we just missed it a little bit. Uh, we, I think it was, what, 10, 10 interceptions, 15 touchdowns. I don't know the yards. Can, oh, Jesus. Yeah, that, that's a lot of uh, time in the pocket there, pal. Come on. Well, okay, maybe, they're, maybe their ground game is going to be a little bit more potent than we were hoping for. Can we bring people down? Thank you. Eckle? No? Oh, you, no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, you better do that, Hopkins. You were not wrong, my friend. Normally, I'd be like, what the hell is EA coding? Nope, perfect coding. <laughs> Absolutely perfect. It, it sounded like I was a chef, like a bakery bakery person. Perfect coding. Or maybe a painter. I don't, I don't know. Um, that's a touchdown. Can we... We're going to the blitz. First and goal. I mean, they came out swinging. And Bosa just came out swinging. Half a sack, but D Ford with a robbery of a lifetime. The actual heisting of a statistic... He did zero. I mean, he kind of set... I guess he set the edge a little bit. We got blocked hard. He's going to be down to the one. Okay, we're going to have to bring the goal line, I guess. I can't believe that. We need to make a stop here because we're we're reeling. There's no doubt about it. There it is. Huge hit by Quan. Could have been a forced fumble. Brock Collins in, you know, maybe try to sneak it in on us, but nah, not happening. Once again, we forgot to change John Ross you know, to the punt returner, but I... Uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's, oh my god, I'm so smart. Oh, well, that's, that's one way. That's a nightmare. That's, that just can't be done. So we're going to look early for the quick-ish plays if we can. I think that could be Pettis right out the gate. It will not be Pettis right out the gate. Quick-ish plays, huh? That's what he says. If you say so, pal. All right. Kittle. 
Maybe we're getting a little... Maybe we're having a little bit too many flashback moments, but... I mean, we almost got a first. Did they got Miles Jack? Up the middle, you know who's getting the ball. Derrick Henry. Good game of about six, five. Over a thousand. Congratulations, my guy. Oh, that's unfortunate. All right. Maybe we're not running the ball as much as we said we were going to. They're just... Every defense is just smoking us at this point. So, of course, you know that this is not going to be a run because that's very ambitious of us. Rolling out to the right. And he misses the throw. You've got to be joking me. I know we also had, uh, was it Petrowski over the middle? But, I mean, the throw is pretty much the same distance. You just can't miss that. You'd, I mean, that's just not a throw you can miss. It's not that hard. He's wide open. So, we come up scoreless. Shocker. We got to we got to evaluate because we're in a game where you know this is a win. this is a not a must win this is a you better win you broke boys I don't, I don't remember where that came from we can't lose this game we just simply can't at the end of the day we we just can't I that's I don't know what else I can tell you if if it wasn't clear enough oh my lord first down every second huh might have the to... now we can't we can't have Sherm travel that's not what he does we're blitzing we blitzing there you go Nick Nick Bosa making a play up the gut run potentially this would be a great stop if it is oh god no 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 back up back up oh Sherman no wow he got absolutely pinball explosioned off the edge we had a fella I got stuck going on the inside. Couldn't get back in time. It sucks. We would have had a sack. That would have been the drive over instead. Looks like more points are headed their way. Good job, defense. Damn, man. Deshaun Watson. To the outside. Nobody's going to be in sight. There's going to be another first down. I don't know how to stop him. I don't know how to stop anyone. I mean, we're not even going to stop him on this ground attack. Let's be honest. Oh. Great play by us. Nick Bosa got. It's not Nick Bosa. It's Fred Warner. Probably just as bad. Got destroyed there. Not going to lie, the second quarter kind of saved us. I don't know why I thought they were going to come out with another run look. Because they clearly weren't. <laughs> and that would have been bad. I would have had a wasted timeout. I don't know how much that really would have mattered. But we'll you know, we'll see later on. And there you go. Covered sack. Bo Bosa Buckner. Not everyone's Bosa, pal. Just in, just in case you didn't know. Bringing the safety off the edge. Fred, you better make a play, pal. There you go, Fred. I knew we couldn't give him time because they would find a way to convert. At least now we have a chance at maybe even blocking the field goal. Who knows? This could be a touchdown our way. Almost had a block last week. It's not. Although the field goal is completely missed. I don't know if he would have even had the leg for it, let alone the, the accuracy. That's poor. I mean, we've been playing AIs lately that have just destroyed us in special teams. All right, left guard. There you go, left guard. First down. Damn, Fox is potentially our best lineman. It's crazy. Like, I get developments do matter when, you know, you're talking about a superstar lineman, but I didn't think it was going to be that much of an issue. You know, a deal, not an issue, because obviously it's a good thing for us. Good five-yard gain. He just, he just smokes him. He just simply doesn't lose often. It's crazy. Please tell me. Can you can, by the way, I've always wanted to know, can you control which way the wheel's going to go or, or no? Yeah, they just chuck it. That's overthrown. And it doesn't matter. Kittle's the dude. There was a really good blitz design. I probably did have the out route. Kittle actually has a 1,000 receiving yards. What a damn season. Wow. Amazing. Absolutely uh, brutally amazing. Insane catch. He almost had the thumbnail last week with that uh, that faded catch. But look at this. Really good positioning for Reed. But uh, he went for the pick when he should. I mean, you see where his hands went. They went outside of his hands. If he would have just went for the ball, who knows? I'm just saying. We are in a situation that could set up the, uh, you know, the stop. Second and three. Got a run look. It's going to be play action. And Nick Bosa is going to get a coverage sack. I don't know what they're thinking there. Got a big front like we have. Got to have something short. Something. Nick Bosa hits 10 on the season. Not going to lie. I'm a little disappointed, you know. This is the season he went up to X Factor. I know it wasn't too far, you know, behind us. But still, X Factor. I don't know, man. I, I feel like he should be doing better. And considering a lot of his sacks have been pure coverage. But regardless, we see ourselves in a lead situation, which is whew, rare. <laughs> we see ourselves leading the game, and we have the ball back. So it's 
keep piling up the points. With us, you just never know when the gravy train's going to come to an, a, a halt. It was a really good move, and holy crap, McKinney was not. He, he's he's all the other guy. He's like, are you okay? That's why I fell down. I, I promise I wasn't ankle broken. I thought you were hurt. <laughs> like, he's trying to make the other guy feel bad. I don't like, I, I get he's shading the inside, but I don't like how, you know, that looks. So Pettis is going to go streaking. Maybe not. We had Kittle, don't get me wrong, but Petrowski, ah, I feel bad now. I thought Petrowski could have easily caught that edge for about 10 to 15 it's just with Kittle, I would have had to wait another, you know, about second and a half, and we would have had to throw it over a guy. I haven't been trusting Jimmy Garoppolo's throws lately. There's a good throw, though. Uh-oh. Ooh, great block by QT. It's exactly what I was hoping would happen, but we couldn't get by. How come it won't let me change my camera view here? What the hell is this crap? Okay, I guess we're just going to hike it with stupid camera view. Watch this. would be a really great play. Nah, it won't be. I don't know why I would have thought. Inside look. Going for these quick plays. I mean, Petrowski's having himself a huge game, but that's not the intention. It's just he's playing the slot role, and that's you know that's the role that's going to get most of the action in between. And Kittle got rocked. The matchup there, he should not have gotten hit as hard as he did. Honestly, hitting him as hard as he did for that guy should have probably been an injury for him. Oh, Ooh. oh, ex whoa. He, he wasn't ready. I will agree with you, random yelly guy. What the hell was that? That's it's a really hard throw to make, but, I mean, the lane's kind of there, Jimmy. And you know, Watson's been under some pressure, but a lot of it has been because of the coverage. You know, it was looking a little grim there early on. You know, we were giving up first down after first down, and then we started to tighten up a little bit. Pressure actually started helping. You know, here we are with more pressure. We're going to give that lane up to the outside, but you can see why. You know, gain of pretty much nothing. We got the, we got the dudes. We got them. It's all right. Got to hope Josh Jones covers his man. Oh, my Josh. I, I kind of let Josh work the, the boundary there. He didn't completely disappoint me because he made the play kind of, but, yeah, he should have done better. He should have he completely clamped that. You know, they both pretty much ran the same exact route. That's why I left it. Oh, he's done. Yeah, I was about to say. The two corners, the two number one corners coming in hot. You know, not a crazy inspiring performance, but we can come out with you know, 13 or 17 points in the first half. That's not bad. You know, once they start getting more desperate on uh, defense in the second half, we might be looking hot. And uh, John Ross just going to run out of bounds. No touched. No touched. <laughs> what does that mean? No touched. Of course, we're running to the side with Clowney, who's already shown some weird teleportation hit stick. Got a nice push there. Oh, come on. I left it out pretty early. Couldn't get it, though. Two-minute warning. We got plenty of time. I'm not worried. Might be looking for the out routes. Really good pickup. Is that John? What a pickup. If you guys didn't see that, I recommend rewinding in a little bit. And I just said rewinding. Okay, Boomer. Kittle? No. Corner out. Great catch by Pettis. It's another one of those plays where even though it's a terrible corner, they're somehow just locking our guys up. Trying to keep the immersion there. But, yeah, that's just an amazing play by Pettis to save a potential turnover. Kittle could be open. He is open. I don't know who you're covering, but Kittle it was not the guy. That's his second touchdown of the game. Back-to-back -back weeks with two touchdowns in the games. Uh, amazing. Amazing. Fred Warner stepping up. Oh, there you go. Who does D Ford? Excuse you. Why would they call a timeout, by the way? I don't know why they would do that. Maybe they're trying to just bluff us out because they're going to run here. I don't know what they're trying to do. I mean, it was a decent bluff attempt. Uh, maybe that's what they're trying to do. They're trying to call a timeout, make it look like they they believe in what they're doing, and then they run it and they sneak away with a first down. I don't know. Maybe. That's the only thing I can think of because other than that, it's just no point. We have two timeouts now rather than what we should have had is one and of course it's not going to be a great punt so John's going to just follow that right side that has been just gaped all afternoon quick throw to Pettis potentially now they're all over it Kittle I mean we're finding some players open now of course once again we know the matchups we're playing not not as hard go back to more out routes however Kittle could be open for another score the way that safety's playing it looks like he's going to try to help with QT he won't, but he's still open. He's still open. Straight up to the line. Then again, I don't know if they ever will find out. 
Maybe had Ross. Yeah, you gotta throw that away. We're gonna have to gonna have to be happy with a uh, a field goal. That's fine. So that's one way to end the first half. Twenty to three. There's still some question marks and there's still some risk, but Jimmy Garoppolo looks a lot sharper today. The receivers look a lot sharper today. Derrick Henry still looks very 50-50. So does the line at times, but pass blocking has been great. Passing has been great. Receivers have been great. Defensively, pass rush has been really good. You know, the first quarter was, you know, early first. It wasn't looking hot. Ooh, this is a good game for us. Come on, Seattle. This is, wow, this is not a good game for them, though. They look really bad. If the defense can keep playing the way they're playing, I mean, it's going to be very hard for teams to beat us. Obviously, you know, postseason's completely different than the regular season, but still. Inside handoff, John Ross slipping away. Almost took the thing, damn. Yeah, John Ross and those inside zones are very deadly. Right up the middle for Mr. Derrick. There we go. We're going to run him over, damn. Wanted to run him over and then go into the stiff arm combo. They didn't give it to us, though. Good job, though. Good blocks. No matter what for Henry, it's always going to be about the blocks, right? Kittle can... Uh, Kittle. Brita can make it happen on his own. That's... Yeah, I mean, I don't even blame Jimmy. I don't know what the hell he's doing there. All right, John, we need to block because they're going to... They're going to be looking. They're late. Just, yeah, just wind it up. I was, I was looking for Pettis. As soon as I saw Walk him off the edge, I was like, yeah, there's no chance. All right, Kittle, make a play for us. We're just going to take the shot. They almost picked that. Could you imagine? I know the punt does give us a really good chance to pin them, but at the end of the day, really, I mean, no, no need to bring that up. He's had a very good day. Where is the wind helping me? The hell? I pinned it right, and it was like, nah, mate, can't do it. We're going to press. Oh, Quan. There you go. Look at I mean, we had we had goons making plays. We had playmakers making goons. What? Come on again. No, back up. Back up. Buckner this time. We're burning. This line. I mean, we knew the Texans line wasn't good, but holy crap. I know we're blitzing, but this feels refreshing. We've blitzed plenty of times in the past, and we don't get anywhere near this kind of pressure. If we can time the snap. No, we can't. We can't time the snap. Back him up. Good job, Sherman knocks that thing out. Get the hell off our field. Like, quite literally. Like, get a hell out of here. 20 to 3. We got to show that we can actually score in the second half, though. You know, we put up 14 points last game in the first half, and guess what with the score finished? 21 to 14. Ooh, a little inside move. It's not going to be too hard now. John is going to get down to the 5. What a return. Damn, John. That was sick. I gotta, I gotta give it to him. That was sick. It would be quite criminal if we didn't get away for John to score here. Like, he's gotta score the touchdown. He's gotta be the one. Off the edge. John! Touchdown, John. That was close. I may have stepped out a little early. I just wanted to make sure we caught the edge. I think we were short. We weren't! I didn't see that. That is so damn close. It's unbelievable. Come with another blitz. Cornerback this time. I mean, we would have finished the tackle there with Flowers. I mean, we would pretty much be locking them out of this quarter with yards, let alone points. But speaking of choke, I mean, this team, this, what is he doing? Like, Hopkins is the first down. Hopkins isn't that type of dude. He's getting the first down. I think Hopkins is way too smart to not get a first down there. Oh, no. That is a dime. Josh Jackson. Wow. Okay. I don't know what happened. I think Sherman maybe got lost in the press. I mean, we have been, the game has been changed by us blitzing. So obviously I have to, you know, stick with what's working, but now we got to be a little bit more cautious. Now we got to really start to think about what we, you know, when we're going to blitz and all that RPO. That's a great play. Great play call. I was hesitant. I want to cover the outside on the in over there, but yeah, that was a good play by them. I, I gotta, I gotta admit good play call five minutes left in the third. Game's still open, but we're in a good spot. As long as nobody, you know, unexpected fumble or something. Poof, I thought they were stripping there. Take your clothes. Well, yeah, I want to run the ball, but, like, look what they just did. They brought everyone up. I think we can still sneak it to the left, but this is a lot to ask for. Not for this team, apparently. Good run over. I mean, I'm, I think at times just trucking people over is the best move. Do I like this? I mean, I'd rather just take QT deep. It looks like they have a linebacker on him. Throw it away. I tried to throw it away. Oh, my God. That's brutal. 
I think I tried to throw it to a player that didn't have a route. I couldn't throw it to the the, the inside there. Too much risk. I mean, we just succeeded on the run, and we just we just don't run again. I mean, that's just not a good decision. Should have run the ball right right away again. Kittle has been naked though, and he he dropped the ball. Are you for real? There's no way he just dropped that ball. There, there like that had to be, like we need a redo. Can Kittle block? Cause I don't even want him running a route. Wow. Okay. That's a pretty good throw. And another drop. I don't know what the hell QT's doing though. QT's got to run into that ball. You let the ball come to him. Jump that freaking ball, dude. We're just gonna kick it straight to him. I think. The ball doesn't bounce like a crazy. Oh, get back there, you crap. No, terrible job by the Gunners. I mean, that was like an eight-second punt. They got to be doing better than that next time. We're going to bring a little bit of a blitz, but we still have the extra help up top. Quan, you can't miss that. Like, you're just not the kind of dude that should be missing those, just simply put. I would assume Quan's the guy that leads the team in tackles for a loss, so I'm not really sure what he's doing in a situation like that. There was a great jump by us with Josh Jackson. I'm just surprised he actually tackled him first time. They're down by 16, and they're more committed to the run than we are. Got the safeties. Safety in a corner coming off the edge. We might just keep white deep, though. That's a great play to the outside. And it's picked off by white. That's going to be a touchdown. No, down to the five. Another move where it sends us down to the five. Good job by white. If we would have taken that bad, there might have been a chance for a scenario, man. That's it. White's coming in. <laughs> Could you imagine? Bring White in for a touchdown. That's a good throw. It's a good throw if he holds on to that. That's left, right, down. Sound like I was entering a G-code. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of the way our offense plays in the second half. I just, I'm just not. There you go, Derek. I mean, I like that. Once again, it's another drive from the five that's just not super hard to com convert. Like, you should be getting those regardless. Almost as bad as letting the uh, Texans ride down the field. What is that animation where he has to jump up for that? He's wide open. I don't know if he just poorly threw. What's the story? But White was destroyed in the press, and game's close again. Love it. Good read. Wow, he's a lot faster than that. Who is that? The Reynolds from the Rams. That guy's a lot faster than I thought he was. You know, he had the bigger kind of frame, so I thought we could easily... You know, baited in the run. I knew, I, you know, I didn't get tricked. I knew it was going to be some sort of pass to the left. I just thought we had the speed to get there. Like, <laughs> McKinney is literally the only player. On, he's doing it again. He's like, are you all right? I'm just checking you out, man. I, I fell down looking at you. Yeah, McKinney's literally on ice skates, like, all game long. I don't know what the hell he's doing. Inside, there's only one way to go, and that's into Miles Jack. All right, offense. This is, it's time to, like, actually go. That's a really good throw. What a catch by QT. I don't know if you guys saw what just happened, but Kittle just got obliterated. Look at this. Clowney's insane. He just, what the hell? Oh my God. What a throw though. I mean, that's insane. But once again, it's a play. It has a good read, good play, execution, all that, but it's another play. Oh, John's got a score. Oh no, he doesn't. I didn't see that guy. John is playing well, man. He's having a game. But yeah, it's just it's another play where you you just don't chalk that up as a win. It's just something you just like, okay, well, that could have went south very easily. Oh, look at the blocking. Are you actually joking me, Derek? Right, O-line, make another amazing play. Oh, my God, speaking of amazing plays, Clowney. There you go. That's what we need to see the first time. I know I went with a stiff arm last time, but that's his specialty. You know, catch him with a stiff arm. All right, the sun is completely eclipsed. I think that's the word for it. Oh, my God, Chase Allen. I don't even know who the hell he is. I just know he comes in every once in a while, and that was an amazing hit. Unbelievable. You know, it comes down to gaping him. And, you know, that's also the kind of thing. He had the inside slant, but he saw Pierce. He saw a couple of different players, went with the safe route, and now they're looking at a third and two where they could, you know, be forced into a fourth down situation. He's going to take the shot. Jackson is in play. Hopkins is player of the week, huh? He's just player of the week. What is going on? This is insane. How is he so good? Okay, it evens. Let's, like, actually stop them one of these times. 
Good D, White. White shows that effort 24-7, man. Even though I think he was the one that was burned on the uh, the Hopkins touchdown. I know Josh Jackson was there, but we still have the deep blue, I'm pretty sure. Maybe we did. I don't know. Maybe we didn't. Oh, that's risky. Thank God we kind of like trapped it against our legs. Derrick Henry started pretty rough since. Pretty good yards per play. And then more importantly, two rushing touchdowns. Good offense is starting to show itself again. There you go, Derek. I mean, obviously we lost a yard, but not much we could have done there. It's just like, they're bringing everyone down. Why wouldn't I just run a slant? Like, why wouldn't I just run a slant? Why wouldn't I just run a slant? I mean, everyone wants me to run the ball so much, but they're bringing the freaking stacked box 24-7. Like, here I can see it. The other one I couldn't. You know, why? Why would you do it on the other one? There's plenty of options. Ooh, John Ross. I did not know it was John Ross. Jesus, that's dangerous. It's nothing big. We just squared up with Bryant. Bryant? Is it? No, Bedard Bedardrick. Okay. There you go, big fella. Bryant McKinney. The old tackle. This could be the dagger from Petrowski, or it'll just be a quick throw inside. Uh-oh. That's really late, man. It's bad by us. QT's got to be a little more aware and come back to the ball there, though. I would have liked to finish a little bit stronger. The score was nice, but it was a lot of defense and special teams kind of stuff that set it up. But still, you know, it was a nice score. All right, everyone, back up. I don't know what happened to Quan. Is he hurt? This Chase is playing a lot of snaps here. Good hit. Quan might have gotten hurt. When did he get hurt, though? Was it like a special teams play that I maybe simmed? That's not good, because I, I didn't really put two and two together. I was just thinking, you know, maybe he was... Playing a little bit. You got to catch that, Chase. You know, it's not it's not about staying on our team or anything. It's about what gives you the best chance of just surviving in the league. Making a play when you, you know, you're in for an injured player. What a play. Jesus, Kevin White is... I don't know what the hell has gotten into in the last few weeks, but he's insane. He actually lost his damn mind, I think. There's no one on QT. Great throw. Great catch. Maybe try to, you know, should have tried to get him upfield, but it's fine. I definitely also thought there was a chance that he, you know, maybe touched out early or something. Pettis could be scoring. Pettis is scoring. For everyone that was mad at us for missing the streak last week, you gotta give it to me. We saw it this time, boys. We saw it this time. There we go, offense. We're back. All right, we're pretty much going to finish the game, you know, in a red zone situation. Can we stop them? The, you know, the game's on the line. Can we stop them? Buckner with his third or fourth of today. Can we can we make the play when it's all said and done? And really good job by Josh Jackson to take away Kevin White's pick, which probably would have guaranteed him a scenario, assuming you can have him this late. Force fumble, a pick for a lot of yards. That could have went for a pick six for all we know. It's unfortunate. Oh, we timed it, but we got to back up. Oh, really good find there. Was our coverage. I just thought that they were going to find that inside look to Hopkins. But hey, there we go. A nice 50-point score. Team was good across pretty much every facet. Defense was really, really impressive in this game. Uh, I don't know what the hell that's supposed to be. Uh, passing game was pretty decent. Blocking was actually really impressive. You know, Clowney was showing his his strength, but you know, he kind of got stonewalled for the most part. John Ross kind of emerged with a couple of plays. You know, special teams, he was really good. And then, you know, a couple of offensive plays, pretty much averaged 10 yards per carry. Henry was okay, and he had a couple of moments, but really the offensive line was MVP in this one. And Jimmy made every read he needed to. There was maybe a few risky ones that could have been picked, but for the most part, we took care of the ball. And ultimately, we did win the game. You know, Deshaun Watson kind of willy-nilly throwing the ball up. We were playing a little bit too soft that game. Three rushing touchdowns, three passing. Pretty balanced stuff there. Hopkins went straight off. Kittle was pretty good. Kind of, you know, disappeared a little bit mid-game. Uh, you know, so at points in the game, Buckner was absolutely insane. Kevin White was absolutely insane. And, yeah, like I said, John Ross, I believe he came out with like 200 yards total returning or something. Yeah, I'd still say there's a chance Kevin White could get it. Yeah, that's not easy for a... Ooh, look at these upgrades. That's juicy, boys. Juicy boys. We'll uh, upgrade that next video, though. AKA next week. And once again, I have no... Ooh, he did get injured. No. No. Well, it must have been on special teams because I didn't sim any other play. Oh, no. 
Broken hand for Quan. Oh, that sucks so much, man. That sucks. That's brutal, man. Uh, I had, no, I mean, I knew there was a chance he was hurt because Chase was in a lot. No scenario either, which kind of sucks. Uh, it would appear. Also, the Rams did win. It would appear we're gonna have to promote Josh Jones yet again. Great stuff. The Bud Dupree era is back, boys. Regardless, really good win, even though we did lose Quan. I might have to start benching these linebackers whenever we're up because they just seem so liable for injuries. But regardless, you know, we're facing the Seahawks could be a team that we face in the playoffs at some point. And yeah, maybe if you're new to the channel, subscribe if you want to see more. Like the video if you did like it. Follow me on Twitter, Jerome P. Care. And maybe check out my second channel, PK or Plays. I don't know. Do something. Anyways, hope you come back for next video. But until next video, uh, see ya.